What's up, guys? Welcome back to the channel. It's me, Brave X Hero, and today we're going to be talking about sliding. Sliding into your engagements to get the upper hand. Now, if you missed out on the TWAB this past Thursday, then you're probably unaware of the upcoming nerf to sliding. Now, hear me out. It is not a nerf to sliding in general, but more of a nerf on utilizing a slide to get the upper hand on your enemy. Now, a few of you have reached out to me asking my opinion on this. Is it bad? Is it going to break the game? Did they just kill the slide technique? Well, on this channel, guys, we cover PvP tips. And today, I'm going to let you know that this is actually a good change. And for me, I personally welcome this change. But before we get into the video, I would love to hear everyone's opinion. So do me a huge favor. Drop your comments down below. Let me know what your thoughts are on Bungie nerfing the combat slide. But without further delay, let's get into the video. Now, on screen, you're going to see the whole comment from Bungie. But I'm going to focus on the bottom part. While sliding, players now incur the following weapon penalties. Minus 20 stability plus 15% shotgun pellet spread, and a 1.5% flinch added to your weapons. Now, that looks pretty intense. That right there is a pretty significant change, but one thing did stick out to me. Bungie did mention that this is a change that looks scarier on paper than it feels in practice in our opinion, and we'll continue to monitor how it plays out. Now let's talk about shotguns. Personally, I feel like this is a great change Lately, I've been seeing a lot of players running around with their shotguns out with no cares in the world, sliding around just shotgunning people. And yes, this is even after the most recent nerf to shotguns. So yes, this is a good nerf to them, and I personally welcome this change. Now, what is going to happen with shotguns now? Well, let's take 8-Man 101 here. 8-Man 101 here never puts his shotgun away. He likes to run around. Bungie nerf quick draw, and he just laughed. Now he just apes the entire game with the Felwinter's Lie. Well, now when he slides, he's going to have a minus 20% stability, a plus 15% shotgun pellet spread, and a 1 point times flinch. Well, now when 8-Man slides into an enemy and fires his shotgun, if he does not kill them on the first shotgun shot, it's going to require them to have a little bit more effort to pull that shotgun back down after it fires because of the stability difference. So overall, that's a win-win there. But now let's add the plus 15% shotgun pellet spread, meaning their shotgun is going to be a little bit more inconsistent, requiring them to land a second shot if they miss every pellet. Lastly, they got a 1.5 times flinch factor added to them, meaning when they turn the corner, when they slide into you to shotgun ape you, if you fire one shot at them, you're going to be doing 1.5 times more flinch, meaning that when you fire at them, their weapon is going to flinch off the target making it much more difficult for them to shotgun ape you, adding the plus 15% shotgun pellet spread, and then if you fire a second shot, even more flinch. Overall, this is a much needed and welcome change. Now let's get into the second part. Other weapons, snipers, fusion rifles, hand cannons, pulse rifles. How many of you out there love to slide into a lane with a sniper and fire a shot at your enemy? Well, man, all these are gonna affect you as well too. Minus 20 stability, one point times flinch, it sounds really, really bad, but hear me out. In all my videos that I've covered the combat slide, I've always said that when you utilize the combat slide, when you slide from out of cover and you fire at your enemy, the goal is to get the first shot. Remember, the first shot isn't going to always guarantee you the kill, but it's going to give you the advantage. And in those videos, which I highly recommend you go see, they're going to be linked at the top. The reason you're sliding out of cover utilizing the combat slide is because when you slide and you fire at your enemy, when you land that first shot on them, you're causing flinch. The whole purpose of sliding out of cover like that and utilizing the combat slide is so you can get the first shot on your enemy. And for my snipers out there, you shouldn't have to worry about anything either because when you slide out of cover to snipe, your main goal is just to get a shot off. The last thing you want to do is stand there and get flinched. And to top it off, this only occurs when you are sliding. When you're out of the slide and you're standing and you're fighting your enemy by strafing, you no longer have the minus 20 stability and the 1 point times 5 flinch. I can see where Bungie's coming from with this whole slide nerf. They want to see a skill gap decrease. But I personally believe that by making these changes, they're only going to be increasing the skill gap. Good players are still going to be able to slide out and win engagements. Sliding is always going to be super powerful and they just made it even stronger. This is why I say if you haven't mastered the combat slide, go check those videos out, the ones I mentioned earlier. Go watch them because sliding is going to be even better. Players who were decent at it may never use it again. Shotgun apes are going to be punished for it, but the player who masters it is going to be extremely deadly in PvP. 
But with the good and the bad out of the way, let's talk about the ugly. Two things that really stick out to me are gonna be slug shotguns. Weapons like the Chaperone and a Duality are not gonna be affected by this in the slug form. I promise you, you're gonna see a lot of Dragon Shadow Hunters out there utilizing the Chaperone. We will see an increase in slugs overall. Lastly, Titans. Titans who utilize Stasis and use their crystals to gain an overshield. Well, next season, they're not gonna be able to gain an overshield, but they will get a health bump. As you see in the footage in the background, we have Prof out here slides into his crystals. By doing so, he gets a health bump and he easily cleans me up with a shotgun. Yes, this is a little concerning for next season, but overall, my thoughts on this, I think that this is a welcome change. I saw a lot of people running around just holding W key or holding forward on her thumbstick with a shotgun and being able to do the one point times flinch on them and a plus 15% pellet spread. That's awesome, guys. It's huge. I personally feel like this is going to lead to a lot more primary gunfights. I'm sure we've all been in this position here. You have a Titan just running at you, holding the W key, and you fire shots at them. For the most part, right now, they're able to kill you. But next season, when all these changes are implemented, this three tap here is going to be a lot easier. Well, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. This is my overall thoughts. I think this is a great change. It's going to be kind of weird at first, but once we get the hang of it, I think it's going to be really, really good. And if you haven't mastered the combat slide, I still say master it. Go out there and learn it. Improve it. Overall, you guys are awesome. Do me a huge favor. Comment down below. Let me know if you are worried about this change or you're excited for this change like I am. With that, you guys are awesome and I'll see you in the next video.